The Swiss Cheese Model James Reason's Swiss Cheese Model is a simple metaphor to visualize how patient harm happens based on a system's approach. This metaphor shows us that in a complex healthcare system, errors are prevented by a series of defenses, barriers, and safeguards, represented by slices of cheese. Each slice acts as a defense against things going wrong. Ideally, all slices should remain intact, but each barrier has unintended weaknesses, or holes, which are inconsistent and are constantly opening, shutting, and moving, hence the similarity with Swiss cheese. If an error occurs and breaks through a hole in one slice, it isn't a big problem. It doesn't usually result in a bad outcome. But sometimes the holes line up in multiple slices, meaning all the defense layers have been broken. When all holes are momentarily aligned, it brings hazards into contact with patients and causes them harm. The holes in the defenses arise for two reasons, active failures and latent conditions. Active failures are unsafe acts committed by people who are in direct contact with the patient or system. They take a variety of forms, slips, lapses, mistakes and violations. Active failures have a direct and usually short-lived effect on the integrity of the defenses. Slips occur when a correct plan is made but is incorrectly executed. For example, you meant to drive to the airport but went into mental autopilot and took the route to work instead. Lapses occur when a step of the plan is omitted or forgotten. For example, you meant to set an alarm but forgot, so you overslept. Mistakes occur due to misinterpretation of relevant rules. For example, you interpreted your flight check-in time as 8 a.m. but arrived at the airport late. Violations occur when a person knows the rules but doesn't follow them, not with any intention to cause harm, but to save time or complete a priority task. For example, you were late for your flight and drove in excess of the speed limit. The police stopped you, resulting in a delay. Latent conditions are hidden in the design and working of the system, environment, or equipment. They may lie dormant in the system until they combine with an active failure to create an opportunity for harm to occur. Latent conditions can cause some of the opening and closing holes in defenses through ineffective training inadequate supervision, ineffective communications, and inadequate staffing. Long-lasting holes in defenses can be caused by ineffective equipment, unworkable procedures, and poor design of devices, equipment, or supplies. The systems approach demonstrated by Reason's Swiss cheese model regards failure as an inevitable result of human systems and believes that countermeasures should be based on the idea that we cannot change the human condition, but we can change the conditions under which humans work.